it was August in 2018 where I connected with Dana Marie. She had been selling Andaras and working with the Andaras for her own amount of time, about pretty much eight months. And I connected with her and she started showing me all these pieces. And I instantly got just sucked in and drawn to them. I felt like I had been just yearning for them already for years before. They were calling me very deeply within my soul, within my heart, and I was feeling the vibrations in my head. I was being activated again with all of these new perspectives and understandings and new wisdoms and insights. So from that point on, Dana Marie sent me a piece. It was a little blue piece. And at th that time, that was a healing piece for me as well. And she sent that to me in the mail, all the way from Georgia to Nevada, to my house. And that was the start of a new relationship between her and I. We connected, she kept showing me pieces, she kept ordering more, and she kept finding more. And they just all came. I was tuning into them and I was just so drawn to them and I knew that I had found a new purpose for my existence and a new mission. I felt that within my soul and I could be passionate about it. That's what, what the cool thing was, was I can do something I love. So I ended up only about a month later and I came to Dana Marie's out in Georgia and instantly it was just so high of a vibration, right? <laughs> because there was these pieces that she had and because she had her business in selling the Andaras and finding new guardians for these Andaras and sharing them with people and just spreading that love, right? And I showed up and it was just crazy how many pieces were uh, calling me that I already had been dreaming about. There were two pieces that I had already dreamt about that I was called to for years and this specific green piece this twin flame piece right it was like my heart piece and that piece is just so dear to me because that represents my heart energy right it represented everything so this piece just I'm still so connected with it and I don't know that I could detach with it. If I had to, I could, but you know, in my dreams, right? I was traveling in nature with it already in my dreams and all of that stuff. Like there were missions I went on with the piece and everything. So that is a little background and history of my story with Andara's. And I know that Dana's story is very amazing as well. She has posted that on the Elemental Ascension page and on her Facebook and everything and shared her story with everybody. It's very cool and you guys should check it out or even ask her if you'd like to uh, know what her story behind it was. It's very cool how things popped up and showed up for everybody and I know everyone has their own story with Andaras. It's super cool and that's how they work. So I hope that gives you a little background on my story about Andaras. Thank you for joining my course and I'll see you in the next video.